Hi, how are you? It's Travis in here, and welcome back to our adventures in Azeroth. Last episode, we went to Tabitha's Arm and did some quests for her. And today, we are currently in Scarlet Monastery Cathedral. I was actually planning on getting our mining up today. And also, uh, you know, just queuing up for a dungeon. I thought it would take us around, like, you know, 30 minutes to get into a group, but I got into one right away, so... Decided to just, uh, start the episode here. Let's get everybody buffed up. Conjure some water. Not too sure how many runs these guys want to do. to see. But I do plan on trying to uh, get some some mining in eventually. So we can get it up to at least 175. Yeah, these are much, much chiller pulls than the the ones we've currently been doing. The last one we were doing like huge pulls. I don't think we have as much AoE. We don't have a Boomkin, but I think Hunter AoE is not bad. Probably make some more manas for everybody. And we should potentially hit 42 today. Be close. Our tank's kind of low level for this. He's like just at a, at a good level, I guess you could say. silk cloth from this. Even though we don't really need it. Try to make some more water so I can give them away. And dragon flight's coming out soon. It's like a couple days away. I think it'll be out by the time this video's out. Hope that's a good expansion. A lot of people are, seem to be enjoying the pre-patch. Evokers are pretty fun. And if I learned a couple of new things about them, they have a, like a really good one-shot that I didn't know when I was playing them. And you can hit, like, pretty much hit somebody for over 50% of their health, which is kind of wild. I was practicing it on a friend. 
We were doing like some duels outside. Just trying stuff out with our uh, evokers. You got this ability called Flame Breath and you can like buff it up. And it can just like, you know, completely really one shot somebody, especially if you hit it with the the tier three part of a uh, flame breath and you can actually proc not proc it but you can instantly use it with an ability in your evoker tree i believe i forget what it's called though and you see like a bunch of evokers just one shot in people <laughs> nowadays now, i didn't understand that i didn't really understand how to, how to do that until uh until i seen it yeah, Flame Breath's very strong. I was mostly using, like, uh, Disintegrate and, like, Rank 1s. Or Tier 1s, whatever you want to call it, of, uh, of Flame Breath. When I should have been using 3s. The thing is, charging up a 3 takes a long time, but if you can, if you can get the instant one, you can actually pull it off. Yeah, it's gonna be a real, uh, real chill run, I think. So I can give him one. I don't know if he needs it or wants it. It's kind of shitty water. Eh, probably doesn't want it. <laughs> it is shitty water. <laughs> 50 mana per second's not bad. It's not good. He's probably got like 65. We have all the gear we want from here. I was looking at the gear. Got the neck. Got the shoulders. I was thinking about uh, this main hand mace, but mages can't use maces, so we can't even... no reason for us to even try to get that. I wonder if this is going to be like a one-time dungeon. It might be. Let him get a little bit of a little bit of aggro there. We'll see what happens here. I think he's realizing maybe he could do bigger pulls. Remember at the last group that warrior was like he was a higher level one though. He's like Post level 40. It's like pulling this entire room. <laughs> let's, let's see what happens here. Looks like he's got a good group here. Go. Priest is like... Right here would be good. Should have some threat. Gotta do a 10-man EOE after this. I that means Eye of Eternity or Eye of something like that. Is that the Malagos raid? I have to go to, like... I think I'm currently in Classic. I have to go to Wrath. Yeah, Eye of Eternity, the Nexus. Yeah, Malagos. It's a cool raid. It's kind of like Nax's version of uh, Nixia's Lair. I mean, Wrath of the Lich King's version of Nixia's Lair. I assume it's a pretty quick raid to do. Something I haven't done yet is any of the raids in Wrath. Gotta get a character up to 80 first. And then maybe I'll check some out. Look, get some gear on one of the characters. Looks like this is going to be a one and done. Dungeon here. This is alright. Take the XP. Trying to get to like mid 40s, anyways. So I want to start leveling in uh, Tanara soon. 
a good place to, uh... To Morris Morris. And get up to, like, 225 there. A little bit higher than that. We'll probably do a little bit of fishing in Tenaris as well. Said he can get another healer. Yeah, I'd be down to give it a try or wait. See if he can get one. Would be nice to hit level 42. Sound goods. <laughs> Spelled that a little bit. got a healing shadow priest. I didn't know that. I think it matters if it depends on like what you're trying to do. I think with the pools that we're currently doing, it's not that big of a deal. But if you pulled more, it would matter. Cloth boots, three stand, ten spirit. Our boots are better. Like the last group I was in, they would pull the boss with all these guys. Like eight mobs and the boss. That group was awesome. I got really lucky getting into that group. These ones are chill, though. Infidels. You don't really have to, like... They must be purified. You know, worry about your mana too much. Your mana is usually always... It's more chill. And you don't wipe. It's another thing. It's pretty rare to wipe with these groups. Like the last group I was in, we did wipe. I like think once or twice. 
Those dots are ticking, man. Shadow Priest is pumping them. At your side, my lady. Almost kills them in that. I wonder, if, I wonder if you can do that, like kill her before the res goes off. With like dots and those. Kind of cool. Shadow Priest is doing a lot. Alright, so there's that uh, mace. Two handed mace this time. And we don't need that, so greed that as well. And that is the end of that. So the question is now, will we find another healer? Or not? We'll have to see. Alright, so I'm going to wait for a little bit here. Oh, we already got a new healer. Perfect. So I guess we'll go summon him. That was quick. Looks like there's a lot of people uh, looking to do these dungeons. So we'll go summon Raziel. See if he got that. Looks like he's getting attacked. It'd be cool to do lib so I get the key, but like once we're done, like done with Kath, like I'm never coming back here. So I don't really care if I get the key, to be honest. And at like level 80, I can just run through here and just arcane explosion and everything and just get the key if I wanted. And we're all high enough level, but do you want to do? Library at like level 41. Damn it. I don't know where are we going. Well, the other 40 guy doesn't mind. Like, I don't know. Like, I don't mind doing armory. Probably do armory. I don't know if I can do, uh, I'm sure if I want to do, if I want to do library. Maybe we'll do library. We'll help him out. Armory's not bad, though. We'll get our next speed. Yeah, you can do way bigger pulls, especially when we go to library. Just let him pull the whole room there.
Okay, well, okay. I guess this is his bowl. I've done ar armory in a while too. It'd be fun to see if we get Ravager to drop. I hope we get it for the warrior. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have it. One thing I like is when tanks do like really big pulls and really test test themselves. It's a lot of fun. I don't. Know, I just enjoy seeing like. A tank pull like 20 mobs. Come on, man. <laughs> yeah, he could do bigger pulls than this, but way bigger. There you go, man. Come on. That's what we like to see right there. Go ahead and get a little bit of egg. aggro. Some other shoulders, better shoulders than that. I'm pretty sure we won't be able to... We'll probably have some gray mobs in library. But I don't mind. We'll get the key at the end. I know I won't use it too much, but... <laughs> at least we'll have it, right? It's part of the collection. I think they removed those, didn't they, in retail? I'm not sure. It'd be interesting to see if they removed, you know, keys. We can do the flame strike wizard combo here. I don't think we can. We don't have enough mana. I think you okay. waiting for him to do that. I thought he would have done it. But I guess he just was like, he was... You don't know, right? When it's like your first time in a place. 
as a tank, you don't really know what you can do, so you kind of just... It's better to play it, I guess. Um, a little bit more conservative, I guess, you could say. I can... Just get some XP. I can get any like loot in here. Let's check out uh Let's check this out here. I just got Herod left. Is Herod the only boss in here? See if Herod has anything. Eh, not much. Mostly just uh, gear for like melee DPS and tanks. It's a good little little pack there. I'm not sure if we'll come back to SM after this. Maybe. You could still, I think you can do Cathedral up to 43. And then we'll probably want to do like Alderman or uh, Moradon. Here we go, the final hallway. Let's see what he does here. So he's got his pull. Nice belt. It's probably like the coolest boss. Ah, in all of Scarlet Monastery. Things gonna spin soon. They give me strength. got wrecked. Not too bad Ravager didn't drop. Oh, this is the, the mage part right here. <laughs> What's this? Oh, that's decent staff. Oh, Tabard of the Crusade. What are people doing with that? Oh, they're needing it? Yeah, I've seen a need there. I'm needing it too then, buddy. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Nice. We're putting that bad boy on. Represent. 
We just got the Tabard of the Crusade. That's awesome. We got an achievement for that. Whip a Tabard. Our first Tabard. There we go. Tabard of the Crusade, guys. Let's put it like this. You can't really see it. Let's do it like standing next to... Uh, all right guys well that is going to be the end of today's episode next episode we will be doing scarlet monastery library and i think we'll probably make our way over to tanaris and potentially do a little bit of mining and make a stop at gadgets in but as always thanks for watching keep your heads up later